On August 1st, Mark Dudley was struck by a hit-and-run driver as he cycled along Route 9 in Madbury, left on the side of the road, unable to move, a long road of recovery ahead. Nearly two months later, Jeff Dudley cycling the same route. It's pretty emotional, you know, when I crossed the site, you know, I took the flag and I put it in one hand, raised it up. On Thursday, after riding to the Dover Post Office, the brother of the man known as Mark the Singing Mailman, also a riding and running enthusiast, jogged Mark's downtown mail delivery route, carrying the Mark's Army flag in his honor. You know, Mark's entered a period of his rehab that's going to be difficult, I think. It's going to be a grind. Results will come slow. It's going to be frustrating. So this is primarily for him. Stopping along the way with enthusiastic banter, as Mark is known to. And I'm glad to hear sure. that he's doing a lot better and uh, tell him that we all uh, miss him very much and we look forward to seeing him soon. I asked him for a specific route so I could see some of his customers and then he goes, oh, well, you got to stop here. Oh, you got to stop here. We miss him as our mailman, as we were just yeah, saying. Yeah, and they're holding his spot for him, right? Yeah. Customers noting their similar looks and upbeat attitudes. Good. You know, we're coming along. Good. Battling good. away. I'm sure he's in therapy right now. Oh, yes. Hoping to get back yeah. on the street. Awesome. He we misses his customers. We miss him. Yeah. I miss hearing him sing. Mark's flag will end up at Moe's for anyone to borrow, and then it will go to Mark when he finally gets home. In Dover, Jennifer Crompton, WNUR News 9.